how to fix the issue where your Windows 11 computer is stuck on the loading screen. So if you're seeing a blue screen or you're seeing a black screen with a loading cursor or you're just having any startup issues in general, then I'm going to show you exactly how we can fix these issues. Now, the very first solution is you just need to hold down the power button on your computer for around about 10 to 15 seconds. So I'm going to do this with you now and we're just going to hold this button for 15 seconds. Even when the computer's turned off, you're going to continue to hold this power button down. After 15 seconds have passed, you can and then go and release this button you can then try turning on your computer and checking if that solves the issue now if that doesn't work then what we need to do is go and load up our computer in recovery mode now in order to do this we first need to turn off our computer using the power button you can then go and turn your computer back on and as soon as you see the windows logo appear you're just going to hold down the power button once again to turn off your computer you need to go and repeat this three times by turning on and turning off your computer. On the third or fourth attempt, it should go and load this recovery screen here. Now, once you're on the recovery screen, we can just select see advanced options. You can then go and press troubleshoot. Now from this window, select advanced options, click on startup repair, and then you can just go through the steps and wait while your computer try and diagnoses any issues with your startup. Now, this may take a few minutes and hopefully this will solve any startup issues. If it doesn't work, then there is one more solution and that's to head back over to the recovery screen by once again turning off and turning on your computer. Once you're back over to the recovery screen, this time we're going to come to advanced options. Go and click on troubleshoot once again and this time select reset this PC. Now you have two different options to remove everything or keep your files. I would suggest selecting keep your files to make sure all of your personal data is not deleted. You can then go and choose to cloud download or local reinstall. Now we're going to press cloud download. If for some reason this doesn't work, you can always try local reinstall and you can go through the steps here to reset your computer back to its original settings. Now, once you've carried out this process, that should go and fix any loading issues with your Windows 11 computer. Let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful.